Ready? And sing. We'll have seven thirds, four fifths and six, seven eighths and ninths, and mix ten tenths, ten tenths makes one. We'll have seven thirds, four fifths and six, seven eighths and ninths, and mix ten tenths, ten tenths makes one. Fractions can be fun, and they may just be fun. Fractions count the parts of one, a fraction family. The top number keeps counting, it's called the numerator. Let's count the slices of pizza left in the refrigerator. We'll have some thirds, four fifths and six, seven eighths and ninths, and then ten tenths, ten tenths, ten tenths makes one. We'll have some thirds, four fifths and six, seven eighths and ninths, and then ten tenths, ten tenths makes one. The bottom number is called the denominator. So you can write the parts in one the fraction family. The fractions can be sneaky and even a little freaky. Two fractions that are the same may have different names. We'll have some thirds, four fifths and six, seven eighths and ninths, and that's ten tenths, ten tenths makes one. We'll have some thirds, four fifths and six, seven eighths and ninths, and that's ten tenths, ten tenths makes one. The one has been two full horns for eight to eight sixteen. These are good when fractions are the fraction family. To find the fractions five that are in disguise, we need a mathematician to do prime factorization. Ten thirds, four fifths and six, seven eighths and ninths, and next come tenths, ten tenths makes one. Whole has ten thirds, four fifths and six. Seven eighths and ninths, and next ten tenths, ten tenths makes one. Divide out the ones to find the true identity, the simplified fraction of the fraction family. If you change a fraction into a fraction that's the same, you can multiply by one and give it a different name. We'll have some thirds, four fifths and six. Seven eighths and ninths, and next ten tenths, ten tenths makes one. Who has some thirds? Four fifths and six. Seven eighths and ninths. And next ten tenths. Ten tenths makes one. Multiply straight across. One half times a fifth of five tenths. Five tenths is the same as one half in the fraction family. Two and one half beats us. It's called a misnomer. This is the same as five halves. So this is a proper fraction. Who has some thirds? Four fifths and six. Seven sixths and ninths, and next ten tenths, ten tenths makes one. Who has ten thirds? Four fifths and six. Seven eighths and ninths, and next ten tenths, ten tenths makes one. Mixing a proper number of one thing in common, we're greater than one whole in the fraction family. The fractions can be found, the need is green and run. Fractions can the parts of one, the fraction family. Who has ten thirds? Four fifths and six. Seven eighths and ninths. And next ten tenths. The tenths of this one.